Hello everyone, welcome to my The Young and The Restless Homies official channel. I hope everyone is having a wonderful day. Before we begin, please hit the subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. The Young and The Restless spoilers for the next two weeks, December 25 to January 5. Warn that Nikki Newman's departure will be terrifying to her family. When Nick and Victoria Newman can't find Nikki, the week of December 25 to 29 will raise some kidnapping concerns. After a preemption on Monday, December 25, Victoria and Nick will be concerned that Jordan has kidnapped Nikki. Victor Newman will be skeptical and will raise the notion that Nikki fled on her own. Since Nate Hastings informed Victor of Nikki's drinking, Victor will speculate that his wife may be on a drinking binge instead of celebrating the Christmas with her family. Nick will act as if Nate could have lied about what he observed, but Victoria knows Nate would never deceive them about something so important. Of course, the Newmans will have no idea what happened to Nikki, who will be busy turning herself over freely to Jordan at a rundown cabin. Nikki will surrender for a swap since Jordan warned Victoria that it was the only way she would ever see Claire Grace again. When Nikki arrives, she'll be confronted with Jordan's gun and all the rage she's been harboring for years. Jordan will supposedly aim to destroy Nikki, but there may be a last-second twist that allows Nikki to turn the tables. Will Claire or a member of the Newman family offer Nikki some unexpected help? Regardless, Nikki will live, so at least the Newmans won't have to mourn her death. Jordan's demise appears to be brewing instead, so stay tuned to see if prison or a body bag is in her future. Christine Blair and Danny Romilotti will discuss their next chapter in the future. Will Danny and Christine agree to rekindle the relationship? In any event, Phyllis Summers should be out of luck once she kisses Danny and is turned down. Devin Hamilton Winters, on the other hand, will make his feelings known during a conversation with Tucker McCall. Tucker should reconsider his plans to fix the damage he's caused. Devin's biological father will be in a bad mood as he realizes how much he despises Tucker. Will Tucker and Phyllis commiserate over a glass of wine? Tucker is licking his wounds over Devin and the way things went down with Ashley Abbott, while Phyllis is pining for Danny. It could result in Phyllis and Tucker connecting in an entirely different way. In other news, Ashley will become increasingly conflicted about Tucker and her true feelings for him. Will Ashley go into Tucker's room and discover him in a somewhat hot situation with Phyllis? Other we and our spoilers indicate that Otter Charles will respond to some shocking news, which could signal the return of Clarence, who was known for his hilarious soap updates in the past. Clarence might have the inside scoop on some drama going on in Geno City and can keep Audra up to date on all the buzz. Michael Baldwin and Lauren Baldwin will ring in the new year at the GCAC with a redo marriage ceremony. Lauren and Michael will reaffirm their vows in order to demonstrate that their love is stronger than ever. Following another preemption on Friday, December 29, action will pick up again during the week of January 1 to 5. In the aftermath of Jordan's altercation with Nikki, Additional information will certainly emerge. The Newmans will be able to respond to the latest developments, and fans will learn what's next for Claire. Michael may have a legal issue on his hands, but he can argue that Jordan pressured Claire out of the psych institution. Let's hope Claire is able to return to her institution as soon as possible so she can begin working on her rehabilitation. Finally, Adam Newman and Sally Spectra should have their first actual date soon or at least their first since they agreed to test the waters of a reunion. Sally and Adam clearly dated in the past, but they're now attempting to start over. Because Adam and Sally's trial run went so well, a genuine dinner date is on the horizon, and it could go even better. According to the Young and the Restless spoilers, the next two weeks will be full of important happenings, so stay tuned in. According to the Young and the Restless teasers, Ashley Abbott will be divided about Tucker McCall's demise. Ashley can't help but feel sorry for Tucker, even though she knows he deserves it. Jack Abbott obtained Ashley's permission before going public with the damaging information and ruining Tucker's reputation. Ashley prioritized Jibot, 
but she'll still struggle with how she feels for Tucker over the week of December 25 to 29. Meanwhile, according to Eli and R. Spoilers, Tucker will suffer another setback as a result of Devin Hamilton Winters. Devin will not provide any optimism despite Tucker's efforts to make atonement and find a way ahead. Devin will compel Tucker to face reality and may warn him that nothing will ever improve between them. Devin will presumably tell Tucker that any hope of reconnecting with his biological son is long gone. Phyllis Summers will be in a similar situation when Danny Romilotti ends her romantic relationship. Phyllis will steal a kiss from Danny, but he appears set to reject her in favor of Christine Blair. There's a significant probability Phyllis and Tucker will run into each other in the pub as a result of this. Tucker and Phyllis may have a few drinks as they eventually commiserate. Of course, this appears to be a scenario in which Tucker and Phyllis hit the sheets. Tucker could easily invite Phyllis up to his room, and she might be desperate enough for some solace to agree. Similarly, putting Phyllis to bed may help Tucker cope with Devon's rejection and Ashley's betrayal. It might be two heartbroken lovers depending on each other during a trying period. Ashley, on the other hand, will continue to struggle with her own heart. Could that take Ashley to Tucker's door, setting the stage for a spectacular sight? Tucker could make his entrance with Phyllis barely covered in bed behind him. It'd be a wonderful opportunity for Tucker to exact some vengeance on Ashley while also demonstrating that he's moved on with his life. Will Ashley witness Phyllis and Tucker's steamy encounter? Could Ashley have discovered the new lovers after a session in the sack? According to the young and the restless spoilers, Ashley may be in for some unexpected news, so stay tuned for updates on all the mayhem that's brewing. According to the young and the restless spoilers, Sharon Rosals may hear updates on how much fun Chance Chancellor and Summer Newman had during the performance. Sharon certainly didn't expect Summer to stand up and take her place when she declined the invitation to attend. Sharon is trapped in a love triangle, whether she likes it or not, and it is up to her to determine where things go from here. Sharon may become tired of the growing competition and shut it down completely. Sharon should not be fighting for a man's attention with Nick Newman's daughter. This plotline seemed to be too infantile for Sharon who has faced with so many mature interpersonal troubles and real-world issues over the years. Sharon shouldn't have to cope with Summer and Chance acting like high schoolers in puppy love behind her back after losing a child and beating cancer. However, because this is the plot Sharon has been assigned, let us evaluate her next step. If the writers of We and R are determined to keep Sharon in this love triangle, she might as well fight back. What if Sharon decides to move in with Chance? Chance may be accepting a significant change in his personal life now that he has left the GCPD and is embarking on a new chapter at Chancellor Winters. Sharon may persuade Chance to live together and convey that she is ready to take their relationship seriously. In case Sharon hasn't made her feelings plain, she may let Chance know she's ready to take things to the next level by sharing a home. Summer could be in for a surprise if Chance accepts to move into the cottage with Sharon. Summer may conclude that Sharon and Chance's romance is more complicated than she previously imagined. Summer may begin to distance herself from Chance, leaving him perplexed about their bond. Chance and Summer's relationship may suffer if Sharon draws Chance closer through their living arrangements. In other words, perhaps Sharon will make a bold move and cause a setback for Summer's side of this love triangle. According to the young and the restless spoilers, Summer, Chance, and Sharon are still in for some surprises, so stay tuned for updates on what's going on in the romance department. So what do you guys think about this update? Let me know in the comments below. And if you like my videos, please press like and subscribe for more. I'll see you guys next time.